Danielle guys. I'm Upsna and I like to teach you how to make beauty fun and easy. Today I'm going to be doing a uh, segment called Beauty vs. Food. Beauty vs. Food is a segment where I test popular lipsticks to see how they last against food. Today we are going to be testing the Fenty Beauty lip paint in uncensored and then we are going to test it against some delicious yet greasy Chinese food to see how well this lasts. As usual the rules are no special tricks so no powder and no tissues. I did this the first time with the powder and the tissues so that's why I am retesting this lipstick again. Second rule is no lip liners because the lip liners tend to muddy up the results so it is just one coat of this lip paint and we're gonna test it out to see how it works out so let's get right into it. We have the dumplings. We're gonna start the taste test and see how everything goes. Okay, first taste. And let's zoom into the lips to see. Okay, looks pretty good. As usual, we're gonna go in for the entire dumpling, aka the entire dish that we are trying out to see how it lasts. Look at that dumpling. These are different than any dumplings that I've had. All right, that's actually been one and a half dumplings. Let's get a little better lighting. Let's get a little more zoom. Wow. Okay, you guys see it. Okay, all the food is finished and we're gonna zoom in. You'll see that much has uh, gone at the bottom of the chin and a little bit has feathered out here and there. But overall, it's really not that bad. It's actually really, really strong and those things were really greasy and really, really slippery. Okay guys, so I am outside in natural light here with the sunlight and this lipstick performed extremely, extremely well. Um, which is funny because it actually comes off when you do that, but eating food, I guess it's so highly pigmented that it's still completely on my lips. Um, not wearing away in the center or anything there. Hey guys, okay, so this is the final check-in. As you can see, I ended up having the dumplings, which were really greasy. I also ended up having Thai bubble tea drinks. As you can see, this color looks as saturated as it did in the beginning, which is amazing. Here's a close up shot for you guys, so you can see that this really, really did perform extremely well. This is definitely, definitely a winner. Two thumbs up for that. I love it. If you guys enjoyed these beauty versus food videos, please make sure to like this video and subscribe for more. I love to make beauty fun and easy for you guys. I will see you later on. Have an amazing day.